to my channel, I know, I'm tanned, right? <laughs> Your girl just came back from Dubai. Because I just came back from 10 days away, I came back to hella packages, guys. So I thought today I'll make a video all about free shit that I got basically while I was gone. <laughs> so if you guys want to see what I received in PR, please keep watching. Okay, so I'm going to start off with the smaller packages. This one is from YSL. I can see from the little label at the front. Thank you so much, Chris, for sending over these bits. Oh, there's an eye makeup remover. You guys know how many eye makeup removers I use. I use so much eye makeup remover and I always use the Duo Face one. So I had no idea that YSL has skincare. Do you have skincare? I have no idea. Maybe it's new. Bitch, I was like, how the hell do you say this name? Demo Qualitant Expert by Face Docs. Bitch, how you say that? Demo Qualitant. I can't even speak English, let alone French, you know what I mean? Okay, so we've got a YSL collector. Ooh, collector's edition. Bunch Ooh, I like the holographic. Have you guys noticed that recently YSL is like switching up their packaging and their freaking target audience? I feel like they're trying to be a bit more young, a bit more hip. Because before I felt YSL was a bit like granny-ish, but now they're getting a bit more snazzy with it, you know? You use the word snazzy. <laughs> I know. So, this is what the palettes are inside. Half is lip and half is eyes. That is really cool, but I actually don't like it when there's lip products and eye products in one packaging because I find if you use eyeshadow, especially dark eyeshadows like this, they'll get that fallout and then it ends up going on the lip product and then you end up swiping some black eyeshadow on your lips. That ain't cute, girl. But this is a really cute, I think this would be a really nice present for someone, you know? And it's really nice to put in your bag as well. We've got an eye perfecting fluid. Okay, so this is like an eye primer. We've got a noir cold pencil couture eyeliner i literally have like five thousand of these because i went to a YSL trip but this is one of my favorite eyeliners the couture black eyeliner oh my god do you know how long i've been wanting to try this mascara this one exactly right here yes this is the one i remember back in the days when i first started doing makeup i always wanted to try this YSL mascara because so many people were raving about how good this mascara is and i remember i bought one because i done so much research on makeup alley who goes to makeup alley still is that rob that's still around i don't know i'm excited to try that mascara and have it back in my life again so our next package is from hourglass and uh, thank you so much for all the love thank you so much rebecca i'm excited to try some new hourglass bit oh so i've got a black eyeliner and then i also got almond buff and sand vanish sticks so i really love the vanish sticks it's not that great if you've got really oily skin but it's amazing on top of other foundations and it gives your skin the most flawless finish ever it's so smooth so creamy so i'm in the color sand if you're like an nc35 sand is the perfect color and i also got buff an almond so one's lighter and one's darker for highlight and contouring but this is almond here and then we've got buff i think almond would be like an nw45 mac terms and then buff oh it's quite a good shade for just my normal skin tone i know i'm tanned at the moment but i think that looks like more like an nc30 25 we're gonna have to try to use it in another video and i'll let you know what i think about it make sure you follow my instagram to see all these product featured in instagram videos so my next package i got is from nyx so this is a little makeup bag it says born to glow who likes makeup bags guys i've never liked makeup bags so i always give makeup bags and giveaways because i get so many makeup bags sent to me and i've never ever used them so oh they got a new highlighting palette mm. and then we've got new highlighting sticks these are more in like blue, there's a pinky one and a really pinky one. I don't really like blue highlights. I've got like a bluish tint highlight on today. This is the Huda Beauty Winter Solstice palette and I put the blue highlight on just for the Instagram video. But I prefer more goldish highlight, you know. So I'm excited to try that. I'm going to definitely feature that in the video. Thank you so much, Nick. I need to whiz through these fast guys because I've honestly got like packages piled up to here. So next package is from House of Lashes and it says, House of Lashes, thankful for X Tweely. Ah! I love it when my name's personalised. And these are House of Lashes. These are amazing if you want amazing eyelashes, but it's cruelty free. So these are all synthetic lashes that they use. Oh, they gave me a Sigma Nightlife eyeshadow palette. I already have this already, so that could go in a giveaway. And then I've got a new top up of the eyelash glue from House of Lashes. That's gonna go straight in my makeup drawer right now. Thank you so much, House of Lashes. This box is so cute. Now this package has been intriguing me it's a red package and normally whenever they send me packages it's always in black so i was like oh a red one and it's filled to the brim just how i like it oh i should have done that 
Oh my god, no. No, Kiko, you didn't. There's a Christmas tree beauty blender. That is the cutest thing I've ever seen. This will be so good for an Instagram video. Jingle bell, jingle bell. Okay, bitch. So this is their new Christmas collection. It's got like a powder brush here. Oh, my god. It's got a really pretty glittery nail polish as well. I've got a strobing serum. Glitter kit. Mm. Hold on now. Glitter. Oh, this is really cute. It comes with a glitter gel and then a silver glitter. The glitter's a bit fine though. I prefer more chunkier glitters. I don't want to like swatch everything because a lot of stuff I'm going to be putting in giveaways. Oh my god, Kiko, you guys always hook it up. We've got mascara. We've got a lip balm. Oh my god, it's just like too much. Stick highlighter. The big ass stick highlighter. Oh, this is too dark for me. I do like Kiko, but I feel like sometimes Kiko, they put out too much product. It's similar like MAC. Like, I remember when I used to work for MAC, it would be like every single month they have a brand new product, but then all the products are like just mediocre. I'd rather have a brand only bought out a collection every like two, three months and really, really good collections rather than bashing out like loads of products in their collection and then they're just like okayish products. You know what I mean? And for someone that has so much makeup as well, I feel like these are like better for people that don't have a lot of makeup. But, oh, this is so pretty. Oh my god, look at the packaging, it's so sparkly. Thank you so much, Kika. Sorry, I rushed through that, but it was just too many products to open them all up, you know? Next up, I've got a box of Dose of Colours. Oh, and it says Happy Holidays. Oh my god, look at this packaging. This is everything. What is this? Vanilla sea candies. I've never seen that sweet before. I'm trying not to rip this out, but not to rip this over because I want to open this in an Instagram video. So there's two lip kits in here. One is called Holly Bay and one is the Snuggle is Real. Oh, the names, the names are so cute. So this is all, oh my God, look how nice this is. This is such a nice set for anyone who loves red lipsticks. My mum would love that. And then this is a set for everyone who likes nude. Oh my God, oh, I love this. This is just a bit of me, guys. Definitely going to be featuring this in videos. Thank you so much, Dose of Colours. On to the next. Okay, so I got a tanning set. This is from Mela Mia Tana. Oh, my God. I'm like the worst at fucking pronouncing stuff. This is how you fucking spell it. <laughs> so inside, it comes with a tanning mitt. Oh, this is good for my Instagram videos. And then it also comes with a rapid tanning clear mousse. I'm not much of a fake tanner, but I love instant tans because I put them on my legs and I don't have to wait if it's streaky and if it develops and all that stuff. I prefer it if I just put it on and wash it off. You know what I mean, guys? You know what I mean? This box I'm excited for. It's quite a big one, but it's really light. So I hope it's not like fucking loads of excess packaging. So this is a really cute box from Beauty Blender and Stila. So this is the Blotterazzi and then it's got a cleanser. It's got like a little goldish... Beauty Blender and an original pink one. Oh my god, how cute is this set? I love the Blotter Artsy. If you guys get really oily, you have to carry this. I don't even carry powder around. I literally just carry this Blotter Artsy. So all you need to do, it comes just like a little thin sponge. And then you literally just blot off your skin and then it takes away all your oiliness. But it doesn't leave you really powdery. Because with me, I have such oily skin. If I put powder on top of my oil, it looks cakey AF. So I also got a Stila Extreme Lash and All Day Eyeliner. Then I got a little cute liquid Lipstick set as well. That's a cute little trio. Thank you so much, Dal Walker, for sending over that package. Oh my god, this pile is piling up and this pile is going down. That's how I like it. <laughs> okay, next up, I got a box from Elemis. I went to go have a facial at the Elemis Spa on New Bond Street and it was just so good guys it was so 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 good it made my skin feel so fresh so tingly and then she just sent me some products that they used and this is the pro marine collagen spf 30 i've got the lms oh herbal lavender repair mask so this apparently is really good after you extracted your skin you put this mask on and it like heals your skin and the woman was saying that like, overnight if you put this on a spot it dries out the spot but it doesn't leave the spot like flaky and stuff this is the dynamic resurfacing gel mask Mm, you know I love a bit of resurfacing and then this is the cleansing oil and then I also got a dynamic resurfacing facial wash as well so these are the only products I've tried from Elemis if you guys like anything in particular from Elemis please comment down below and I'm going to try those out too but I'm excited to start off with this first you know what I'm saying okay guys next up I have a really cool delivery and I unboxed it yesterday because my sister was like, I want to see it, I want to see it. But I'll show you what I got. If you guys don't know, I'm getting a new ass 
for Christmas. <laughs> That's gonna be my Christmas present to myself. I'm getting a new booty and a new flat tummy. So I'm getting liposuction, fat transfer, BBL, whatever you wanna call it. And if you guys don't know, you can't sit on your bum for six weeks after your surgery. So there's like a special pillow that you have to buy. So I saw this online and it was like one of those sponsored ads on Instagram and I was like, oh, I need me one of them. So I ended up clicking on the page and they look so cool. So basically it comes like this and it's called Booty Buddy. <laughs> and it's designed for people that has had the surgery obviously. And basically what it is, it's like a, a pillow. And what you do is you literally just perch on it and your bum hangs off the edge. So your thighs go here. Can you guys see it has like two little dip things so your thighs go here and then your bum's hanging off the edge so that basically your bum cells don't die because the new fat cells they need to cling on to a blood vessel that's how it survives and if you sit on top of it it's more likely that the blood vessels will die and then you end up with a bed bum a flat bum or you know you need to keep those bum nice and puggy so this is like essential after you have your surgery and then it also comes with booster board so if i want to sit up a bit higher this is the board you put on underneath and then it also comes with garment shoulder pads so when you wear your garment it's like really really like you no know one that digs into your shoulders this like helps out with that and then i also got this which is an anti-roll belt it looks like this Oh my god, it's literally like two balls. This is what it's going to feel like to be a man. Two balls and you basically put this on your back and you just belt up like this. It's so simple, you probably make one yourself at home to be honest. But basically this helps you from not rolling over at night time because throughout the night I literally like rolling all over, doing a roly poly and stuff. So when you wear this, it's quite hard. So basically it will tell you that you're trying to roll over and then you wake up. So you lay back on your front so yeah this is called the booty buddy anti-roll belt i'll leave all the links to this down below for you guys if you are interested and then i also got this which is really cool so this is basically like a it's like a backrest that you put on so that basically you don't have to keep leaning forward you can actually lean back and then obviously with the booty buddy below and this supports your back this is like an extra add-on that you don't have to buy but i thought it'd be good for like the plane journey and stuff like that so i got this from eos and it's the hydration bundle but look how cute it comes with little bubbles oh my god i'm gonna have to do bubbles right about now how cute yes intro oh my god i'm gonna have to get glad to blow this in my intro while i'm posing so basically, if you guys don't know what EOS is, it is a little lip balm and it's like shaped like an egg. I don't know, and it doesn't really moisturise your lips that much to be honest, but it's just such a cute product. I think it's good to like give us like stocking fillers and stuff. So next up, we've got a little package from Iconic London. This is cute. You, Fortnum and Masons? What? No. It's an advent calendar from Fortnum and Masons! Ah! Thank you so much, Iconic London. Oh my god, is this in collaboration? Iconic London exclusive for Fortnum and Masons. What? How exciting! Oh my god. I'm one of those girls, guys. I do not open these all at once. I wait day by day to open them. But these don't have numbers on them. The hell? I guess I'll just make up number one, number two, number three, you know? So I also got this little brow kit from Brow Bar. And this is called Bold Brows. It comes with three brow products. It has a brow powder, a brow corrector, and then a highlighter i think this would be more of a present giveaway type of situation because my eyebrows are tattooed so and next up i got a package from bh cosmetic and this packaging is life look at this color pattern this peachy kind of pink with this black Ooh, zodiac i love zodiac things guys what color is gemini oh my god it's the ugliest color of everything this is gemini that is not a gemini they shouldn't name that better oh my god i, I don't want to look at this now gemini should be like this gold or like what else should gemini be like a purple or like a blue or something gemini what the hell gemini is like an air sign so why do we need to be like blue or something what's that some ugly gray nah man let's see maybe it has potential in real life this is so cute though god this is such a cute idea look it has eyeshadows out here and then matte shades here and then a highlight in the center these are really nice and pigment let's try libra oh my god that's really mm. you'll try gemini even though i would never go for the shade in real life so the silver and then sagittarius looks cute as well it's really soft the formula yes i love the fact it's got a shimmer matte it's got a black there it's got brown transition shades got olive green oh i love this oh my god let's look at this highlighter highlight is cute Oh my god, I'm definitely gonna do a video with this. Let me know down below if you want to see a video using this Zodiac eyeshadow palette. Mm, I like this idea. Okay, let's do swatches. 
That was like such a shit swatch, but that green looks cute. And that highlight's cute as well. I actually quite like that. When I looked at this, I was like, ah! But when you actually see the palette, it's nice. It's got a good size to it. Very lovely. Lovely jubbly. But don't you think it's such a waste? Look at all this packaging for this one palette. And then I also got this. It's a collaboration with It's My Ray Ray and BH Cosmetics. This is pretty. Love the colour scheme. Oh, so it has two palettes in one. So it has a little, oh, I love that it has a mirror. It has eyeshadow. It's got your highlight and contour. Mmm, I like it. I might have to film a little video with this as well. Oh my god, BH Cosmetics. I've never thought about BH Cosmetics before, but they're up in the game now. Yeah, sure, sure. Then, oh, she also bought out some brushes as well. Oh, what a nice collection. I'm definitely going to have to use that in a video. What do you guys want to see? Do you want to see a It's My Ray Ray collection? Or do you want to see that Zodiac palette thing? You want to see both? I don't know. Comment down below, girl. We're nearly done, guys. Nearly done. We've got some new lip gloss creams from Lancome. Nice. Colours a bit bright, but okay. Any other colours? Oh, they've got a matte one as well. Oh, this colour's hot fire. And then they also gave me a Tint Idol stick foundation. They gave me one last time, but it was so freaking light. And there's one that's so dark. This colour's fucking pink as fuck. I don't know what's up with high-end foundation and the pink ass shade, bitch. No! Let me see this one. 116 Cafe. That does not sound like my shade, but okay. Definitely not my shade. Why don't brands research the influencer before they send out things? Because it's like such a waste of product, do you know what I mean? I have one more little package and then one big package that I want to show you guys. Oh my god, this is so cute, guys. This is a multi-masking expert kit from Vichy. So it has like a clarifying pore one, a peel mask, and then it has a quenching mask. This is so good for stocking fillers, guys. Perfect for Christmas time from Vichy. So good, love that. Definitely gonna do a little Instagram video on that. And then, guys, this is the big main attraction. Oh, ow! This product was meant to come before I went to Dubai because I wanted to shoot some amazing outfit shots for my Dubai vlog. I wanted to film a look, but while I was there using this product, and let me show you what it is first. So, me and Grang got a crane this is called a gimbal or crane and basically what this does is it helps you shoot really smooth shots so if you guys ever watch like desi perkins vlogs or like any really high-end vlogs or any like cool outfit stuff and you see the camera like pan around really smoothly 99 probably 100 of the time is never the camera actually hold it with their hands because if you guys don't know your hand's actually not even holding it straight. It's, you know, when you turn it, your hand's shaking a little bit. So it's really hard to get a really smooth shot. So that's why you need something like a crane to shoot with. And this is what you shoot with on a big DSLR camera. You obviously you can get like cheaper ones if you have like a small little camera or like shoot with your phone and stuff. But this actually supports like big cannons, like my big Canon 80D. And it looks so cool, guys. I was playing with it yesterday. So gutted it did not arrive in time for my dubai vacation but it's here now so we're gonna have to wait until next year until i go on another fabulous holiday to do a look but i really want to shoot a look but next year that's gonna be one of my resolutions i really want to do like a cool look but comes like this oh look at high tech it looks like a drone oh my god guys look at it it literally looks like a robot in here so cool i actually don't know how to use it i'm gonna need grand to like show me but this is what it looks like Oh, and it has a handle. Oh, so the handle goes in here like this. Oh, bitch. Oh, bitch. Oh, yes. So here it has like a little remote thing here. And this is what you get. Do just really smooth shots. Obviously, you guys see it's like spinning now. But when you put on your camera, it balances on here like this. And you can literally run up and down the stairs and it will look like really smooth. It won't be like... You know, it'll be like smooth panning downstairs. This is really good for anyone that wants to take their like YouTube to the next level, want to do lookbooks, outfit fucking videos and stuff. Yeah, I've just been really wanting to do something like that. So that's why we ordered something like this. But I think a lot of people don't really talk about stuff like this. And me and Grand done loads of research into cranes and what would hold the ATD and stuff because we bought one before and the ATD was too heavy and it kept like falling over. It was so annoying. We also got this separately and this is like an extension handle. Oh, it's all dismantled. But basically it's like a long pole. The crane goes in here and it's got two sticks here. So you can basically like hold it and use your whole weight 
on it because can you imagine holding that stick for like one with one hand it's like so draining so this it has the whole bar and everything so you can like zoom really close if you guys watch desi perkins that's what inspired me because i know she does like really cool like drone shots and stuff and i just want to take my youtube to the next level and be more fancy smancy you know 2018 be on the lookout okay guys so i'm gonna leave all the links to the crane down below if you guys want to get it for someone for christmas i think it'll be like the most amazing christmas present for anyone that's into photography anything like videography like when i went to morocco why so they had a photographer and he done like a little lookbook for my friend cc and literally looked so good he had the little crane and he had this one actually and it was like zoom around smooth and it was just so so amazing i was just like i need something like that so it really inspired me to get my ass in gear if you guys are excited for that please make sure to give me a thumbs up and show me your support down below please let me know if you enjoyed this unboxing video it feels like every single time i go away it's like oh i need to film my unboxing video when i get back because i got hella packages so if you guys haven't yet please make sure to subscribe to all my other social media platforms it's just x tweetly on snapchat twitter instagram and facebook guys enjoy the bloopers and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys oh my god i've got a cut on my tongue it's so painful okay so what's up falling down what yes my wife's being in the bloopers <laughs> my mom just gave me some ointment for my cut for my braces gets this from like freaking vietnam it's probably got like cocaine in here or something oh my god it's oozing out ah shit oh my god close it quick oh my god look at all that just oozed out why do i get high from this shit and i'm just like <laughs> Is that how you look like when you get high? I don't know. Can you guys see all the cuts in my tongue from my braces? Ugh. Ugh. It doesn't taste like anything, it just textures gritty. Bitch, what the hell happened with my eyeliner? Oh hell no, bro. Oh hell no. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Oh bitch, my ponytail isn't high enough to whip it like that. <laughs>